in the islands of Papua New Guinea, the fighting is known and it has been the part of the gods. Uh, in the past, uh, the trouble fighting has limitation uh, where fighters are using bows and arrows and they know the targets and they fought in the battlefield and apart from the village and they followed the rules, traditional rules of fight. They didn't burn houses, they didn't kill women, they didn't rape women, uh, kill kids and they didn't um, innocent lives. And at the time there was no iron man where mercenaries were used in the past was okay and it the fight is well coordinated and manageable and then even inform the enemies uh, before they can get into fight uh, they have to agree on the battlefield which is apart from the village and the garden they have to fight about a kilometers maybe two three five kilometers away and the fourth in the morning the afternoon they stopped and they may continue next day and it was well coordinated and and the, the traditional rules were taught in the men's house as a traditional institutions where the knowledge has to be passed but now it's fade away uh, to do modernizing uh, world that changes the lifestyle of the society. Most of the youth were now do away with traditional rules. They are not, there is no men's house. Uh, the leaders who now lack knowledge of the rules, they are not preserving it. And now you see influence of Western worlds in terms of uh, watching too much Hollywood movies like Rambos. They try to imitate in themselves that they are rumbles. They can kill, they can destroy, and they can do whatever. And because also added to that uh, influx of illegal firearms, which you see the ordinary people in the village, they cannot afford to pay for these uh, firearms, uh, factory firearms, uh, which is too much costly. And also it's impossible for them to smuggle that weapons into the country. And it is a very uh, threat and risk uh, to our public security and also pose a threat to our national security. And, and we need the law enforcement have to step up. They have to, they have to have a penalty a strong penalty to go against the, those who purchase the firearms, those who smuggle the firearms, and get on hard on those who indicate the problem.